Well, good morning and welcome back to a sweet first stop. <clears throat> got a chair with an umbrella. We still got all the junks in here from yesterday. We uh, made the determination. Let's not let this stuff build up at home. Let's get rid of it. So we're going to take this apart at some point today, hopefully. Get rid of it versus hoarding. Uh, you guys aren't coming. These are all unfortunately steel, but there's still weight. We got a drill. Sweet. With a hole saw attached. There's long cord too. I don't know that we're gonna beat yesterday, but if we can, that would be amazing. We are. All right, guys, that's that stop. Let's get her after her and be stuff her once, right? TV, anybody? You're a diaper genie, aren't you? Yeah, I don't want you. That's just, that's just a baby TV. We gotta let that grow. Got ourselves an early two for, wow, we've got so many of these. This is a Fisker. Ooh. Fisker needs a little bit of oil, I think. Man, I would hate to have to use this to mow my lawn. Pushing that through St. Augustine grass would not be fun. these chairs what do we got six seven eight chairs already I wonder if those will stack inside of those let's go check our twofer umbrella crock pot art oh we got here I don't really want all of this oh this is gonna be Star Wars I think yeah yeah, Yoda, Chewbacca, R2-D2, that's fun. You can come. What's that, that's a baby, a baby thingabobber. Star Wars stickers, dinosaur stickers. This one's not in great shape. I think I'm gonna take it anyway. She might be able to get rid of that as Vintage. Let's see if we can figure out how to get all this in one go. Hoo Yeah, don't fall. Don't fall. Nobody fall. The problem is we got stuff. We didn't empty the back. Didn't empty the back of the vehicle. It's a nightmare. Those were all those clothes I was talking about with all the really nice dress shirts. Here's the, this is the Norse face jacket, I think. Yeah, really nice North face jacket. It's got an insert or it might be a second jacket. I'm not sure, but we'll look it up. North face is premium reselling goods. All right. Let's go. Yes, Father's Day is also going to get new patio furniture. Ooh, these ones are going to be aluminum though. Let's see if we can't get all these guys to merge, turn into the, what's the big transformer guy called? Megatron? No, that's the bad guy, isn't it? Uh, you're not quite wide enough. Dang it. You guys go inside these guys, probably not. 
too wide. Look at all the water coming out of those guys. Uh oh, that board's that board needs to get done. Alright, aluminum. Oh my gosh, those things were stuffed. That's why they're so heavy. Stuff with the water. And that's why they rust. Could have just lost 10 pounds. <laughs> Scared me, kid. Morning. <clears throat> Kids out here hustling. He's selling cokes out of a cooler. I have to get one. I like to promote kids that hustle. Wish my kids were out here doing that. You guys got anything? Ooh. They do. What are they? Molding. More molding. This is all new. Too bad I don't need molding. More molding. Oh. Onward. Let's try that way. I think this will be a faster. We're hoping to find some pickers today, man. Oh, there's some stuff in here too. Didn't expect that. A little bit of shelving. It was a nice cooler bag at one point. Oops. You guys all stay in that box. We'll take you though. All right. We're getting there. We got another one, guys. What's up, Bubba? Get out of the road. There's another go for a tortoise. Go on, get across. Yeah, keep going. <laughs> All right, we're like, you're not supposed to touch these guys unless you're moving them to safety. And that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna move them over to the side that he was going to. Then he's out of the road. There you go, Bubba. Now go climb in the woods. And look at the car. Yeah, she got washed yesterday. Look at that. <laughs> Turtle saved. Guys. We're back to the window spot. Oh gosh, someone broke some glass here. Wasn't me. <laughs> it was probably this window right here. One without glass. <laughs> oh. They've been replacing windows here for a couple of weeks now. They gotta be almost done, I would think. Not that we've had tons out here, but you can go up here by the other drywall. Let's see if we can, no, those aren't gonna. Those are big boys. We're not carrying one of the big ones in this little baby one. Yeah, there we go. Whoo! Oh. 
trail doer. Whoa, you go back. Here we go. Onward. All right, looks like we have a clothes rack and this is a, probably a hand sanitizer holder. Where are all them grills at? I guess it's one day on, one day off. One day on, one day off. Patio here. Shunk. I think these ones were aluminum in the past. These feel steely though. Yeah, they're going to be steel. Dang it. So I guess out here, everyone's getting patio stuff for Father's Day. They're not getting the standard grill that everybody else is getting. Maybe a printer. Uh, let me drag this in one, one drag. That'll still work. Big old bulkiness. All right, let's see if I can get this in one, one pickup here. Yeah. Stay in there. So we're not blocking our space. Here we go. All right, kids, let's go. Wow. All right. <laughs> I saw another GoPro chart us. Uh, there's a lady walking with her kid. She will take a picture and Instagram it for sure. I don't know what's driving them out of the dirt. Maybe it's just too dry for them to stay in their holes. That's three in two days. That's a lot. Normally it's the opposite. It's the wetness that draws them out. But not in this case. I don't know what's going on. But they're on the move. Right by this one, there's all these bags in front of stuff. And then I was like, oh my gosh. Look at that. There's weights here too. Whew. Glad we didn't miss it. I know it looks pretty, pretty decent, but we got so much fluff in here again today. Ooh. So much fluffy stuff. What do you got? 10 pounders. Let's load them up. Oh, I'm not that strong. <laughs> oh, we'll go double-handed here. You can hold this in. You can hold that in there. Whew. at my shoes not good yeah all right right ayanda perfect all right let's roll a lot of you have asked about uh, steel rims. This is steel rims here, but these ones have the tires off 
And I know I can remove the tires, but then I gotta get rid of them. What's up, Baba? Um, but I'll certainly take them tireless. But it's a lot of effort for not a ton of weight if we take the tires and then I gotta figure out how to dispose of the tires because the yard charges more for the tires as a penalty than they do for the weight you gain. So it's, uh, it's a lost cause unless you can get them empty like that. Onward! Just regular chair patio cushions, which leads me to believe someone might have been here. I don't think so though. I don't think they would have left these other metals. You come back over here. Pew. Aluminum. Someone had asked, see these stoves? are almost always steel. The inside, some people said, someone asked me yesterday, are those stainless? <clears throat> yes, anytime something can be stainless, but for the most part, those are generally steel, so I do not check them. But I see a chair about five houses up. Maybe we'll uh, do some warp speed again. Well, that was fun. <laughs> I used to sell these. Everlasting comfort. I sold mine under uh, comfort, uh, cloud cush, I think is what I sold it as. Oosh. White label on Amazon. <clears throat> did really well while it did well. Let's roll. Looky, looky, Americanos. I thought these had gone extinct. <laughs> Finally got a grill today. Look at this fire pit's pretty nice too. You know that that fire pit right there was probably two hundred dollars now. Is that crazy or what? Crazy, crazy. I've seen them at Tractor Supply. There's a little fancier. Well, maybe this is hundred and fifty. Still, it's not even rusted through yet. Where are we gonna go with Mr. Grill? Mr. Grill, I think, is aluminum. Certainly looks and feels aluminum. Guess we're going up top again, huh? It's gonna keep stacking, I guess. water system it's gonna be nothing too important there these are fiberglass those are plastic this is the only metals here We found this little mini fridge and I just threw it on here because I was like, oh, we're done. But no, we got another grill. No grills for the first 90% of the run and now we're finding all the grills. And we've got all that fluffy stuff in there and he's got no place to go. So we're gonna go, why didn't you rolling, dude? This guy's missing a wheel. He's in all kind of bad shape. I guess he's gonna go right there with another strap. What do you think? That's about the only choice we've got, isn't it? Go here. Look that shelf. There we go. Stay. Stay. 
Thank you. Onward. Alrighty guys, we've made it to the yard. And what do you know? Captain Kevin's here. He's micro scrapping. He said he hadn't even been out yet today. <laughs> Let's get all the stuff from last night. Oh, I didn't get my clippers. He's taking every last bit off of that water heater, cutting it and twisting it and all kinds of stuff. Oh, gotta get my regulators. So uh, we're gonna get this unloaded and we're gonna go relax. Yeah, that's the game plan. Where are you at? There you are. Oh, there's that dang stainless steel that I never take. That, now that I told you guys that, I'm like, it's just right there. We should take it, shouldn't we? <laughs> we will. Whew. This warming up. Fast, my friends. Okay, let's see what we got going here. Oh, that just pulls out nice. Beautiful. What are you two? Oh, you're under nothing. Yep. He sent you stuff? There wasn't much in that. There wasn't anything in the back, really. A couple of. I didn't even see them. I figured they weren't out there. I figured they were running late because yesterday they didn't run Cypress till late. Oh, they broke down? Okay. Yeah, I run most of it. There was a little bit of the front. I kind of skipped around in the front because I knew Phil had probably been there. Yeah. There we go. Self unload. Trying to give Kev the intel so he can. Actually, we're going to take this to take this to uh, Jill. She was looking for one of these. She had two already, but I'll check and see if she wants another one. No sweat off my back. This one's a room in them. We need to get this stuff out of that one. Whew. I actually don't even remember picking up that baby straw. It must have come where this one was, huh?
Oh, I was gonna say, what are you doing back here? <laughs> <laughs> some prepare to drop off again maximizing the profits Whew. Ooh. Ooh, that was a tire I don't know if you can hear that or not. It's foam when they blow up. Oh. Oops. Oh, I almost lost my colors. All right, guys, this be it. It's time to uh, go see Jeffrey. After we break down these doors that we didn't break down yesterday, as long as, oh, I clipped the wire and then threw it, brilliant. Let's go get that. Wow. Gotta check that, or not. Alrighty guys, we're gonna break down a couple of things. We'll catch you over at Jeffrey's. Let's do some NFJ. Oh, I was enjoying the air conditioning while I was waiting for the person in front of me to finish up. Jeff, you better close this door for you to have a person in here. <laughs> I was like, Jeff better close his door before he gets another person, and there's already someone behind me. Maybe I should have dumped my bin, huh? You didn't? I thought you did. No, you could dump that. I dumped that one. I didn't dump this one. Because you're, you're doing all these, right? I'm doing every, everything. It's all going. Oh. Everything's gone. If it's not broke down, it's not getting broke down. I'm spent. You're taking it easy today, aren't you? Easy? I don't know about that, man. This heat, there's nothing easy about this heat. Yeah. That's why I said the scrap is melting. Seriously. So hot, the scrap is melting. You gonna give me clean on that, Jeffy? There, I got the handle screws off for you. That four grams. Put those on 
that scale. That one I'm keeping because it's actually a little heavy. You want these over here, Jeffy? Yeah. Where's this going? That's aluminum. That's aluminum? You ready over here, weight wise? As long as it doesn't touch the floor. As long as it don't touch the floor. Deal. That's heavy, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, dang it. Forgot to see if Joe wanted this. Because she was looking for an umbrella stroller, but yesterday she had two. So I wasn't sure if she was still looking for them or not. What is dirty stainless pay different than uh, dirty uh, a light? Heavy. That's just gonna be heavy. Heavy? Why? Jeff. Who's being thrifty now, Jeff? <laughs> <laughs> Who's being thrifty now, Jeff? Penny more than what? What? Clean extrusion, right? It's clean, it's just got a little bit of glue on it. Come on, brah. It's uh, how many times do you, do you say, come on, man? <laughs> come on, man, I could get, I could get a big number. I can make a deal with whoever wants to win. Oh. Get over there. So is this, you're not gonna do the extrusion on this, Jeffy? Come on, baby. <laughs> Attaboy. <laughs> Mine is two pounds. It's probably not even two pounds. Oh, there's no screws in there, bro. I can find them. Uh, I bet you could add them. What? what is the best state to get school supplies? Pennsylvania. Ah, you've seen that one before. No, I just come on. Just struck me. You just struck you. Come on, I don't believe you. I don't believe that for a second. <sighs> Man. And Delphine's back. Yeah, that's oh, good. Hey, remember that branch? At my house that I pointed out. Oh yeah, it fell. It fell. <laughs> Last night. <laughs> we haven't even had any storms yet. That's surprising. Man who fell into a upholstery machine. Oh, I know this one. Oh, what's the answer? It's fully recovered. Fully recovered. Yes, yes. What is the difference between Neptune and Earth? Between Uranus. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's probably a better answer. There's a world of difference. Wow. What's the best thing about living in Switzerland? Switzerland. Switzerland. They have good chocolate? I don't know, but, but the flag is a plus. The flag is a plus. What do you call the best butter on the farm? Churned. A goat. What do you get? I'm, I'm sure I said this. What do you get when sheep do karate? Uh, lamb chop. There you go. Because you did pork chop yesterday. Pork chop, yeah. yeah. All right. What's a duck's favorite snack? Quackers. Cheese and quackers. Cheese and crackers. Yeah. <laughs> All righty, guys. We're weighed and paid. Man, it is blistering out. I know I said this yesterday or the day before, but it's just... Oh boy, I might have to take the summer off guys. I hate to break it to you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not taking the summer off, but I do have a new, I do have a new thing I want to start doing. Um, 
uh, uh, Polly Prophet did something similar to it like a year ago where he did questions, answers, but he did a single video. What I'd like to do is throw some questions for me that you'd like to have answered and then I'll keep, start keeping track of them. And then each day, I'll answer them. They can be scrap related, like why do you do this, or how do you do that, or what do you think about this? They can be about me, they can be about Orlando. Just ask me a question. I'll pick three of the ones from today's comments, and uh, we'll cover them at some point, either during the run, or if for uh, some reason, if I don't write them down properly or whatever, we'll do them at the wrap up. But. Uh, that way we can have a little bit of funsies, uh, either learning something new about Matt or learning something new about scrapping or whatever it might be. I might even have to look up the information. I might not have the answer. Uh, or maybe I'll just tell you I don't have the answer. Depends on how lazy I want to be. But throw me some questions in the comment if there's anything you would like to know. But uh, let's dive into the receipt. We had another decent day today. We started off uh, not uh, really uh, crazy, but uh, we slowly filled up and we kept getting there and we polished off with a couple of grills. It was too hot to break everything down, so I turned in even those doors from yesterday dirty. It's just, ugh, man, it is, like I said, it's brutal. I, you just can't stand out in the yard, you start to melt. So, uh, receipt, 10, 1160. Just over a thousand pounds, seven cents a pound still. Yes! No drop yet, which means we're at the Thursday and still no drop. So I'm hoping that uh, we've uh, got past that uh, scary thing that they, they were going to drop down to super low numbers. $81.20. Irony Light was all that, was actually most of the stuff that probably could have been extrusion. But like I said, it just got to go. 101 pounds. It actually was those four chairs as well. Uh, 33 cents a pound for a 33.33. I like that one. 33.33. Irony Heavy was the door to that refrigerator that was stainless steel. Um, and the, what else was there? Oh, the drill. The drill that had that uh, um, whole bit on it. 20 pounds, 25 cents a pound for five bucks. Clean aluminum was the grill lid and a couple of those panes from the windows. Uh, 18 pounds, 45 cents a pound for 10 or uh, 810. And then extrusion, we just had one piece of clean extrusion, six pounds, uh, 67 cents a pound for 402 for a grand total today of 131.65. Hit our numbers both ways. It's like playing poker. Hit it both ways. That's good to go. So we still haven't found a bunch of pickers, but I'm still happy that we're making money on the street. We still have to get all these clothes listed. We didn't even get them out of the car yesterday. We still got the wine rack in the back too. So that's what we're gonna do today. Try to get uh, things uh, situated and uh, ready to uh, end the week and enjoy the weekend. But we're getting in that pool first because it is hot, hot, hot. So uh, make sure to smash that thumbs up on the way out if you have not done so already. I would much, much, much appreciate it. So uh, remember, it's not just stuff. For that, I mean, you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy, and we'll see y'all then.